Hey, Tom, how are you? Hey, Patty. How are you doing? Very good. I mean, we're living in such interesting times, and we're all at home. <laughs> I know. I'm in my home shop here. This is the Money Fit Garage. <laughs> Listen, I mean, this is perfect time to, you know, get to those projects that everybody's been putting off. So what can you tell us? Uh, what are the best home improvement part projects we can do on our own? Well, I'll tell you what, I got a nice set of cabin fever reliever projects for you, Patty. So first of all, let's talk about painting. Now, painting is one of the fastest and easiest ways to improve your space. And now there's new technology in paint making it easier than ever. I'm talking about the Valspar Signature Paint Plus Primer. Now, this product will cover any wall in a single coat. Uh, it also has a stain-resistant technology built into it. Now, I tested this by painting over a wall that was pretty badly scuffed up, and I was impressed to be able to cover it in a single coat. But then I actually dribbled on some coffee and some grape juice, made a real mess of that fresh paint job, and then let it sit for a day, and I was able to wipe it off just with a damp rag. So it worked really, really well, and I think that's a good place to start. That's available at Lowe's. Now, if you want to update your windows, why not put some beautiful new blinds on? You can do that right from the comfort of your couch with selectblinds.com. The technology that's been deployed here is amazing. First of all, they've got hundreds of styles and colors and types, even motorized blinds. They start as inexpensively as $9, so that's a great thing to know. And the way it works is you choose your fabrics or your styles. They'll send you up to 15 samples for free, so you can actually see the actual blind material and fabric, make sure it fits your needs. And then once you've decided, they'll help you with the measuring process. They'll build them, and they'll ship them, and deliver them right to your doorstep. Now, installation, pretty easy do-it-yourself project, so you could definitely handle that. And you'll be looking at some beautifully new decorated windows in no time at all. And next, let's move to the floors. Now, flooring projects extend your living space really nicely. But if your living space that needs to be extended is a basement with a cold, damp concrete floor, well, we've got a solution for that. It's called the dry core subfloor panel. Now the dry core subfloor panels go down directly on top of the concrete and they create an air gap between the floor and the concrete. So the moisture that's in that basement concrete floor has a place to like dry out and vent out. It's not gonna build up there and ruin the floor or make the basement smell musty. Uh, it's just gonna dry right away. Now these panels uh, can also soften the floor from the hard concrete and once they're down, you can leave them like that if you just want that sort of a floor surface, that rough floor surface, or you could put your finished floor right on top of it. So the finished floor in a basement, for example, could be a vinyl plank, could be an engineered uh, hardwood, or it could be a laminate. It would look beautiful right on top of that dry core subfloor panel. Now let's move outside the house. Now, a lot of folks are going to be dragging out those gas-powered lawn mowers and such right now and having trouble starting them as we do every beginning of every season, but you really don't need gas powered gear anymore. You can use cordless lawn tools. For example, there's a line called the Greenworks Pro 60 volt platform. It's at Lowe's exclusively. And all of those tools work very, very well. And I've got a lawn mower here in my shop today, which is the 21 inch self-propelled mower. I like this because First of all, it has the capability to add two batteries, which is the first time in the industry it's ever been done. When one battery runs out, the second battery takes over, uh, and you can actually cut up to about 40 minutes per battery. It's got some other nice technology built into it. It's got a turbo button, so that increases the blade speed, which will let the grass clippings become very fine. You can let them basically float right back down to the grass to become fertilizer. It also has a smart cut technology that adjusts the power based on the thickness of the grass. So if it's really thick, it's going to step up. And if it's thin, it's going to slow down, and that helps preserve the battery power. And the nicest thing about this, which is kind of a neat feature you don't think about, is that you can fold this and store it vertically. So there's no gas or oil to drag out, and it's quiet, so you're not waking up the neighborhood. So very good time to go with uh, cordless lawn tools. And lastly, let's talk about home safety. Do you know that unattended fires, cooking fires, number one cause of fire injury in the country. And we're doing a lot more cooking right now. So we wanna make sure we have the right fire safety gear, including this, the first alert fire extinguisher. This is the rechargeable extinguisher. Now I like this because it's a really sturdy, well-made product, about 30 bucks. You can find it wherever uh, these first alert products are sold, just pretty much everywhere. And you wanna have one on every level of your house, right? And also in the kitchen, uh, and in the garage and in the laundry room. So this way you stay safe. And after you have it, make sure that every adult in the house knows how to use it. And I'm gonna give you a simple acronym so you can remember that it's PASS. Pull the pin, aim the extinguisher, squeeze the trigger, and then sweep it from side to side to put out that fire. So there you have it. 
five good projects you could knock off in a single day. Thank you very much. Please stay safe. Thanks. You do the same.